was wondering where you see the future of F1 lying from a technical standpoint. So obviously there's the uh, change in engine regulations uh, for the year after next. But uh, you know, do you see more aerodynamic changes or active body components like uh, DRS? Uh, you know, think well, I think it's important with the regulation changes that we're a little bit careful with them because Formula One, there's three fundamental elements, the driver, the chassis and the engine. And all three should have equal measure in many respects. And if you start to get out of balance with that, then I think Formula One you know, has the risk of losing its, uh, its appeal. And Formula One pioneers new technologies, semi-automatic gearboxes, braking technologies, and, and a lot of these energy recovery systems and hybrids are now technology that, that, is, that is at the pinnacle in Formula One and finding its way into the automotive world. But it's got to be wheel-to-wheel -wheel racing. It's got to be man and machine at the limit, um, you know, racing against each other. Uh, because otherwise, if it becomes a, a, a technical uh, exercise, it loses its appeal to the public. People come to a Grand Prix because they want to be entertained. They want to see cars and drivers go head to head with each other. So whilst it's important that we have a responsibility on future technologies, it's also important that we don't lose the DNA of, uh, of what we are. So uh, in terms of a sport, um, and, you know, that's why, you know, I certainly hope there won't be electric Formula One cars, um, you know, in, in years to come.